I know you. You you are the you are the weird person who comes to watch my Dungeons and Dragons videos. Yeah, you are. All right. All right. Yeah, let's get into it. So, uh, this session is mainly focusing on the Lutheran Foy and Z, our new character. Uh, Jayoni left the party, so I just said that while going down the river, she drowned. Uh, Frumpish wasn't there, so yeah, there's that. Uh, they have met Z, and in the descent they hear an explosion. Yeah, so they go away and follow it, and they see that there is a building that has been blown up, or mostly blown up. And they see Jorminder with his boomstick, or what, or his blunderbuss, and he is using it to fight some mages. I, as, while they're fighting the mages, they take them all down, and immediately after, boom, uh, er, there's an earthquake that happens, and the and, um, the entire continent feels it. And in the distance, they hear the loud shattering of glass from from the from ice storm that. The Elven Kingdom, which is the big bad evil people. Yeah, so... Now what ha is happening is that we've got all of our characters, and now... Uh, I told them, make dexterity saving throws. Everybody fails, except for Buck. And even then... Th they have fallen down into the, into the crack of the earth that is now here. And... <laughs> they fall down into a very... Com into a very convenient tunnel, and they all get split up. Uh, Foy goes down through the through the main tunnel, and gets knocked out out on the way. Ba and Z go down the le right tunnel, and then Z's warg gets flung into a separate tunnel that was inside the tunnel of Z and Buzz tunnel, and then we got Foy and Yorminder who fell down the right tunnel. Now, Lutheran and Jorminder, they have found, they uh, get up and start fighting some kobolds. While this is happening, Ba and Z are walking through this abandoned mine shaft. This, is an, this entire thing is an abandoned mine shaft. And in there, they find a black pudding. It doesn't sound horrifying until you see what it looks like. Look at that thing. That thing is horrifying. Anyways. So they start fighting and... Uh, we'll go over Lutheran and Jorminder. The two of them, they ha are... Are fighting. They have killed bo both of these kobolds. And they start running through... Through here. Through a tunnel above a bunch of... Uh, giant lizards come up. I love lizards. I love... I love reptile. So as that's happening, and they start running, uh, they... We've got Ba and Z, and they are now running off into the distance, into an adjacent, uh, tunnel. And at the end of it, there is a cliff. Z clenches onto Ba's back, goes piggyback riding, and jumps, and they jump off of the cliff. And they do a f and Bu rolls a natural twenty on on athletics. Boom, Pfft. does a does a superhero landing onto the ground. And immediately while this is happening, Lutheran and Jorminder just got out of the tunnel as it is collapsing in on them. Now they are they are talking with each other about how to you know how to get out of here and also where the hell is Foy. And now we cut over to Foy. Foy wakes up and everything is completely black. There is they she cannot hear or see anything. So she rips through this web-like substance. It's a, it's a it's a spider web kind of thing. It's basically just, "Hey, you're trapped in a spy you're trapped in a spider web cocoon. So, what are you going to do? You're going to roll a strength check." gets out and sees in the distance that there is a giant spider and looks over 
and there is a cocoon with a green arm sticking out of it. You know who that is. It might be Gabo, to be honest. It, it was. Anyways, uh, he is fighting... She is fighting this giant spider. Uh, all of the other ca characters run in. Lutheran runs right underneath of the spider, casts Inflict Wounds, grabbing onto its abdomen, and boom, it gets slammed down and gets knocked out in the process of being slammed on by a giant spider. Ba runs o in there to get ga Gabo, and Lutheran uh, rolls over the spider, heals, heals Lutheran back up to three health. Amazing. Amazing numbers. Very high. Very high. So, it, and Ba rips off the cocoon that Z Gabo is in, and holy crap, he is a cripple. <laughs> so, uh, the, as they walk out of the cave, being scared to, to basically to death, they meet some Mykonids. And they go into a. Sh and Mykonids are basically just this. They are sentient mushroom people, and they live in colonies. So, after getting high with the Myconids, <laughs> they go off and and go to the Sovereign. The Sovereign is basically the king of the Myconids, or basically the mo the biggest and most royalty of them all. Notice that Gabo still has said t that teleportation device. It's still got two charges left. So... They uh, are talking with the Sovereign, and Jormungdur basically uh, says to the Sovereign, we are looking for more reinforcements just for the, for the war. And the, these mushroom people have been affected by the elves, the high elves of Ice Storm. So, there's that. And then, there's, and then last but not least, we have... The teleportation device thing. Everybody gets teleported to Buzz Original Village. It's completely destroyed, decimated, houses are basically ripped in half. And Buh hears hears coughing from from her original home. And in here the there lies her father. Laying there <laughs> holding his hand over his stomach because he is he is bleeding from said stomach. And as... And Ba runs over to talk... To try and see what's going on. And with his last breath says, Take my, gr my great axe. <clears throat> it will... I know you've always wanted it. And this is the day you get it. And... And as, as it is taken from his hand, he, he looks up. <laughs> that was sad. But that's, this session has, ta this has taken a dark turn. It went from, haha, sex, 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 to death of your family members. And in the adjacent, in the adjacent hut, Z here is crying. And in there, there is a there is a young, a very young, probably seemingly five year old, uh, full orc sitting down crying, and Z is trying to comfort her, succeeds in doing so, and takes her outside to meet the rest of the party. And this kid's name is Bree. Orc names are really weird. So basically, Bree talks about uh, how the, the High Elves destroyed the village, and she is scared to death about the session. It was... it was... I uh, did a very short explanation of it, but holy crap, it is a lot... it went on for so much longer than you would expect. So... Anyways, I hope that everybody likes this episode of D&D Stories. And I will see you all later. I want you to subscribe, like the video, 
uh, you you really you really should subscribe. Punch that notification bell through the next dimension. And last but not least, I would like everybody to have a good day. So I'll see everybody later. Bye. The doctor is in.